Hi friends, Miss Allen here with day three of your science lesson. Really quick, I want us just to review the parts of a tree. What is at the way, 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 way top of your tree? The leaves, very good. What are your leaves attached to? Your branches, awesome. What's the tall, strong part of the tree? The trunk, you got it. And what goes into the earth to suck up all the water? The roots. Awesome. The very tippy top of your tree is always the leaves. Yesterday, we talked about the cycle of a leaf. So if you go ahead and peek over at my science journal, you will notice that I colored my science journal so, so, so nicely. I started by coloring the bud green. A normal leaf in the summertime is green. It turns yellow and then orange and red and finally brown. And then in the fall time, it falls to the ground. Great work. So today for your activity, all I want you to do is I want you to get the leaves that you collected on Monday. These are the leaves that I collected. What you're going to do is you're going to sort your leaves. There are lots of ways you can sort your leaves. For example, I think I want to sort my leaves based on color today. So I'm going to pick one of my leaves. Hmm, this one looks a little brown to me. So I'm gonna put this over here in my pile for brown leaves. Next, I'm going to pick up another leaf. Ooh, this one's really pretty. This one looks kind of red to me. I'm gonna put this in a pile for my red leaves. I'm gonna make another pile for yellow. All right, what color does this one look like to you? This one looks kind of yellow. You might say it's brown, but to me it matches the yellow leaves the most. This one's another really pretty one. It looks kind of red to me, so I'm gonna put it over here. Now I'm going to finish sorting all my leaves based on their color. Awesome. Once you have sorted your leaves one way, you are going to try a second way. So I'm gonna put all my leaves together again and put them to the side. I think this time I'm going to sort my leaves based on their size. So I'm gonna try having a big size, a medium size, and a small size. Hmm, let's get started. I found my smallest leaf, so this is going to be my small pile. This leaf right here, it's probably my biggest leaf. So I'm gonna put this in my big pile. Now I'm going to go ahead and start sorting. This one matches my small leaf pretty closely. This one matches my big leaf pretty closely. This one looks pretty kind of small, kind of medium. I'm gonna put it right here in the middle. Ooh, this one is pretty tall, but it's really skinny. So I'm gonna say this one's also a medium leaf. Just try your best. I'm gonna keep sorting my leaves until I'm all done. Awesome, it looks like I got quite a few big leaves. So here's my small leaf pile, my medium leaf pile, and my big leaf pile. Cool, now I'm gonna try sorting them one other way. Hmm, I know some friends in class sorted them on the way that they Feel. So some of your leaves might be soft, some might be a little crunchy, some of them might be a little rough. You can sort your leaves based on how they feel. You can also sort them on their shape if you wanted to. If you look at this leaf, this leaf looks kind of like it's pointy at the top, it's kind of round down here. This one has a very specific shape. This one here is really long and skinny. This one has a very specific shape too. If I look at this leaf, this leaf shape almost matches this leaf shape. So I'd say these two look alike. So I'd sort them that way. Also, this leaf has a very interesting shape that closely matches this leaf. So these two would go in a pile. These match with that one. This one is a totally different shape. So I'm gonna keep that in its own pile. This one looks kind of like, oh, I'd say it looks more like this one. This guy goes here, and this one can go here. There you go. Now I, sh now 
I sorted my leaves based on shape. You can also sort them based on their color, their texture, like I was saying. You can think of a lot of different ways to sort your leaves, but your job today is to sort your leaves in at least three different ways and then put your leaves all the way back in your bag, clean up, and you're done with science for today. Great work.